special honor for me to be here today to help kick off our 4th of July weekend, and that is that distinctly American holiday that marks the birth of our beloved country, the United States of America. And I think it's appropriate today that we recognize all who are serving and have served our nation, active duty, reserve. We want to thank and recognize you today. We're just outside of NATO headquarters here in Norfolk, and I had the great privilege and honor of addressing uh, so many assembled here today. Representatives from all NATO nations were here, and many, many American families and servicemen and women. And what a great way to kick off a 4th of July celebration. We had the Drum and Bugle Corps from uh, Williamsburg here, and of course the, the Navy Band was here. And my remarks, my brief remarks, what I shared was this, that uh, it's a special uh, occasion here. We're mindful of those who have paid such a heavy price to uh, allow us to have the freedom that we have. Those who are on active duty now and those who have served either active duty or reserve, all of our families uh, of those men and women who are serving and have served, and, and a special welcome as always for our Gold Star families, those who have lost a loved one in, in service. So it was just a very special day, great way to kick off the 4th as you, as you get together with family and friends and enjoy all the traditional trappings of the 4th of July. Uh, let's all just pause for a moment as well and just remember what a, what a great blessing it is to live in the United States of America and may God continue to bless this wonderful nation and you and your families. Have a great 4th.